Hey guys, welcome back. Now, a few different things. A few different things have gone down. First off, I donated, because the game is excellent and definitely worth the, um, the donation. It gives you a few things, like you can have custom tiles for your character now. I don't really see the appeal, because I don't... I don't think gear up changes on your custom tiles, does it? No. No. Um, it, the option's still there, though. It gives you a couple of items for an item vault. So you can go to a certain place and drop a couple of items into it and then take them out on another character. And it also gives you another class, the Stone Warden, is it? Dual Shield. Stone Warden, I think it's Stone Warden or something it's called. Stone Guy. Stone Dude. Um, he's a, funny enough, a dual wielding shield guy, which is pretty, which is pretty alright, especially for a donation class, it's pretty fun. I, I had a quick go on it. That's another thing as well, I, um, I, I did play quite a bit yesterday, and it was a couple of days ago when I recorded the first six parts, so I shouldn't be fumbling around the menus and the general gist of the game as much as what I was doing before. And there was some, a couple of other things as well. Oh yeah, mouse cursor wasn't being recorded. Now, I don't think it makes a big difference. I don't think it makes a big difference at all, but I guess it's, it's nice to see at least which, you know, which direction my focal point and my mouse is in compared to normal, well, how it was in the first six parts, but I don't think it makes a big difference. And the, I noticed on the save screens and ch changing levels or generating levels, you'd see the f recording counter, like fraps, it's not fraps, but you know, that's what a lot of times you'd see that counter, you'd assume fraps, it's not fraps, it's dexter. Far superior to fraps, by the way. A lot of folk ask me, like, oh, what, pro what recording program do you use slash recommend that? It's like, as far as I'm concerned, there is only one nowadays. It's fucking Dexter. The best recording program ever made, and especially, cons I mean, I was sitting a clip before I started recording this. I'd, um, I'd given up on any new recording programs coming out. It's why I was kind of stoked when Lightcam came out. It's like, well, yeah, it's, it wasn't perfect, but at least it was a new good program that would come out. I thought they stopped doing them. And then Dexter has come along and just blown every other recording program out of the water. Seriously, even if you're streaming, Dexter is good. But any, it, it, it's just awesome. There's no point going over the good features of Dexter. It's all good and superior to any other program. If you want a recommendation, if you're recording games, that's the one. But anyway, like I say, it was showing the um, Dexter account, which happens in some games. I, one that I can think of top of my head would be like Silent Hill T uh, 4, was it? Or 2, I can't remember. And um, when you changed, or when it, when you changed screen, or it loaded and stuff, you'd see the counter in the top left usually. I mean, it's easy enough to get rid of. I just don't have a counter displayed, and I can see on my second monitor that's recording. So easy as that, really. I just don't get a frame rate counter, which is no big deal. And I assume that won't show it. It still might. It still might show it. I don't know. But like I say, a fair few bits and bobs have changed. Like I say, more experienced. I've donated. I've. Um, Tweaked a few things that, like, the, showing the mouse cursor and, you know, hopefully it doesn't disp- I don't think it makes a difference. It's the mouse cursor and the frame rate display, I don't think it makes a difference. It done, does it? But still, if you're gonna do a job, do it right. Oh, yeah, and uh, finally, I'm not gonna continue the cursed from part six. Um, not because I don't like him, because I, I found his skill descriptions the most awesome skill descriptions ever. I, um, I had a, like, when I was playing around yesterday, I was on the, um, the Wormic class, or Wormric? I, I don't, I, I don't, either way, let's see what it's actually called. I think it's Wormic or something like that. And it seems pretty solid, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna play Wormic, seems though that's the class that I've, uh, I was playing around a lot on yesterday, and I, di I didn't get much that far, like, I don't think I got past about 11 or 12 on him. Oh, yeah, sorry, there, there was another thing, I told you there was a fair few things, I told you a fair few things. I, um, I've disabled the old RPG graphic add-on pack thing. So we, we had a f um, more than a few, like six parts of the, um, the add-on pack. I thought, let's have a few more without the add-on pack, uh, pack and then I'll decide which I prefer the most. I've got to be honest, already I prefer the UI of the original over the add-on pack. I mean, it's like I was saying to Claire, like, really, you should have had it vanilla to begin with, but... I spent more time reading up before I started playing than what I actually played. So everybody was... I mean, there are a lot of folk going, oh, it's a great game, but you know, it looks not so great, but it's a roguelike, so it's okay. But everybody was raving this old RPG pack, and it is a nice pack, but I think it's a nice pack if you've probably played a lot of the normal game, and you're like, I just want it to look a bit different. Then it's probably nice, considering I'd not played anything until a couple of days ago, 
Should have really left it vanilla, but it don't matter. It don't matter. Anyway, um, what use OTG's name? Because I thought I'd just use fucking Liam. There we go. And I think I will go Karnak. I don't like the extra talent category point, though. It's like, I mean, it's pretty useful for infusions. But I don't, especially on the Wormick, the guy's got like a million talent trees as the fucking Wormick class. I, I, I don't want fucking Wormick, I, I fucking know. But, um, yeah, he's already got enough talent trees. I don't really need, is, is that a male or female there? I can't tell. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, he doesn't need any more category points. I don't think so, anyway. Oh wait, no. Gift of the Pure Born's pretty fucking nice, actually. It's like an extra heal, and it's pretty solid, and it, I think it scales with willpower, and you get willpower in a worm. No, I'll go higher. Go higher. Right, here we go. Still thought that looked like a woman there, on that top right thing. Right, generic points then. Let us slap a point into... You see, already there's a synergy between the... Gift of the Highborn, it's, uh, as you can see there, it regenerates life over 10 turns. And then you've got Wild Growth, which adds extra turns to any regen effects. And then stuff like Fungal Growth, which every time you're healed, you gain a regeneration effect for 6 turns that he heals you for 25% of the direct heal you received. It's like, there's a lot of synergy around heals on this class, funnily enough. But it's got some really awesome, like, normal spells as well, like I like the, um, are the icons different? I think, no, I think it's just the UI that's changed the look of the icon stuff. Like I, said, I think I prefer the UI of the default, but definitely already. But the way I was playing him was really going to town on this um, acidic spray early on. And it just, you literally press Z, you run around, shoot something, it dies in one shot, press Z again, shoot something, it dies in one shot, press Z again. It's fucking great. Not make it sound great, but it is. I can't get that yet, I need more willpower. Let's put willpower up a little bit, and we'll have a bit of strength as well. A uh, class point, what are we going to put it into? I'm not sure if I'm going to put it into anything yet. I don't need anything. Fuck it, I'm going to save it. If I don't know what it's going to go into, I'm going to save it. I will, however, increase my Gift of the Highborn. There we go. I do accept changes, T.Y. You are one of the higher, the most powerful and respected lineages of men. Many of your kind serve as high councils, uh, councillors in various allied kingdom cities. Not you. You want more. They say they're various, but not you. You want more. You need to prove your worth and make your own place in the world. You have decided to venture into the old and wild places of the world, looking for ancient treasures and glory. You have come to a land called the Derp Fields. That's the same as usual, isn't it? The second paragraph, yeah, on the western border of the Phaleron Forest. Phaleron Forest. In search of Trollmire. It is an old forest infested with trolls and all kinds of wild animals. I, 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 I know I said this before. The, the joke is tired already, but it's YouTube, innit? To the west lies another dangerous place, the old ruins of Corpul. You heard the caves below it were infested by vermin and undead. Oh, yep, character's been registered. You see, it's, it's, it looks, you see, I, I only look, I, I, I didn't even, I stood a little bit over Claire's shoulder, but the, the majority of the game I saw Claire playing was uh, room to room length, so I could just see it from like, you know, a distance away. My vision is shit without my glasses on. So I thought, oh, it looks alright, but you know, not so great, and stuff like that. And when I was reading the forums and, you know, like, and other people's opinions, stuff like that, and the, the lay into the graphics a little bit, it's like, it looks fine to me. I think that looks fine. I mean, I was saying, oh, do you know, f folks saying, oh, do you know, with the, um, it looks like a little bit like a cheap RPG, uh, Western RPG with this pack and uh, normal, and a, like a cheap um, Eastern RPG with the add-on pack and stuff like that. It's like, I don't know. The old RPG pack was fine. The UI was a bit, hmm, especially compared to that. I think this is a lot nicer. But the look itself was alright. I think it was a little bit, I want to be the guy sometimes, you know, like a mishmash of sprites all in the same screen. But other than that, it was fine. But I, I don't know, this seems alright so far. Let's actually get to a... Wait a minute. It, as if it knows. It, it, it's got the icons laid out a bit more sensible as well. Like, just by default. 
Like, it separated the nuke and the heels and stuff like that, and the brakes and the sustain shit, and then the items, right? That's what I'd do normally, that, but it's just done... Yeah, it, it copies what you've first done, what's that Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, I was gonna say, Claire was just saying then, I don't know if you heard, um, it copies what you did last time, so it must have slightly remembered... Ah, that's clever, is that? Yeah, look, giant... It's not as cute of a giant brown mouse, but... It looks more like... A, I suspect the orcs actually look green rather than orange. So that's that's going to be bonus points when you see it as well. But no, it looks fine. Look, giant white rouse. It's, it's fine. Look at this guy, though. What, what stopped? Yeah, it looks... I think this looks fine, mate. Oh, what are you doing? Pick it up. There we go. Uh, trolls don't look quite as good. Yeah, I, okay, I, I can see, like, there's probably going to be some stuff that looks better and some stuff that looks worse, but I think this looks fine. <laughs> look at this, look at this fucking wormit guy go, though. Told you. Just run around on a, on a way. You just run around on a mission of destruction. Sometimes you got to melee stuff, unfortunately. Forest troll. Hedge wizard. Why is he fucking there? Is he unique? This old looking troll glares at you with malice. His muscles appear atrophied, but a certain power surrounds him nonetheless. Does it? I'll surround him with a certain power. Beat the shit out of him. What did he fucking shield up at 5%? Die. Oh. Is your shield gonna die today? There we go. Oh yeah, leveled up. Take all. Let's scry some shit. Small crystal fire that captures sunlight during summertide. That's very nice, Liam. What does it actually do, though? Um. Ah, oh, there it is. Healing mod plus ten percent. Go on then. What did it, it equip it to? Oh, there. Oh, okay. I can't even go, man. It's like smash. I mean, just run away from shit if you really want to, and then just fucking wreck it. Look at that. It's, it's, it's just a beast in the early game. I mean, I'm not sure. Obviously, I haven't played a late game. I, what was my max level now? Was it on the Shadow Blade still? I think it was. But I, um, I haven't got any further than that. Like I said, I did play yesterday, not recorded, on different characters. Well, you don't believe me? I can prove it to you. I can prove it to you. I can load game. Not on here, I can't. But no, I, I can fucking prove it to you. Like, nah, you fucking... You died on your curse, didn't you? I fucking didn't. It's right there. The curse just seems a little bit too complex for me still at the moment. I don't know, like... <laughs> is it? Well, every hero I say seems too complicated for me. It's actually turning out to be the easiest ones, but... Um... It was the curse mechanic I didn't re- I, I, I did get it. It just seems like I wouldn't fully utilise it as good as what I'd like yet. And it seems like a class that I'm going to really enjoy, so... I shall wait until I'm a little bit more savvy. At least you can- oh, actually, at least you can see when I'm clicking and stuff as well with the mouse cursor enabled, so... Like I said, I apologise for the rather, um, rough uh, first six parts and stuff like that. Well, I don't know, there's- few bits and bobs, it's no world major. Like I said, I do wish I'd have um, just kept it vanilla rather than putting the old RPG pack on straight away because I suspect some people might have been like, ooh, to that. But, I don't know, it was alright. It was, it, was, it was almost like playing a 16-bit, well, 8 slash 16-bit hybrid kind of like roguelike. Like, you could have almost had that on cartridge back in the SNES days. Can you imagine how well these roguelikes would have done back in 16-bit days? Holy shit. Or even 8-bit days. And the, the graphic capability was there for them. Yeah, wasn't the one on the NES? I'm sure there was one on the NES, or somebody made one for the NES, like, way after us. Well, yeah, these are... I think these are done better than Final Fantasy back in the day. Shit, I like this a lot more than Final Fantasy. A lot of folk get a bit cheesed at me when I lay into Final Fantasy, but like I said, I just don't find the combat very satisfying. The stories are great. I could watch them. Easily. I could watch them. But the combat, I don't know. It's just not my bag. I liked it in Chrono Trigger level. I think that was my problem, you know. I, got, I played Chrono Trigger, 
and then no. I was fine with Final Fantasy until Chrono Trigger. That was it. And then after Chrono Trigger, I wanted that kind of battle system. And even though it's not that much different to Final Fantasy, it's still it's enough different. Anyway, anyway, like I say, I don't bash Final Fantasy. I'm just saying, I'm not the biggest fan of the combat system. Uh, lead on, yeah, I protect you. I'm afraid I've lost myself in this place. Oh my god. Right, this is what I learnt yesterday as well. Don't fire acidic sprays while standing behind the NPCs. That leads to a lot of frustration. Actually, one tile away from getting the NPC to the... You got you to get him to like a portal. In fact, I think it's there. No, it's not. It's just an infusion. You get him to like this certain point and then they go, Oh yeah, well done. Here's your reward and stuff like that. I shot me on guy. One shot at her in the back. She's fucking watched right in front... I was trying to shoot a rat. She watched right in front of it. Trying to get to the portal and then got nuked. It's like, well, that's not my fault. They are a bit dumb. Like, don't walk in the lo line of fire, man. Like, she's she's just run off to the top by herself. And she doesn't know what's up there. You've got, you've got to, you can't auto-explore with them. Because they don't stand still. Unless you trap them in somewhere, they don't stand still. They just carry on running around and then you, you just fucking lose them. Duelist Wild Infusion. Help! Bees to the east! Bees? I didn't level up before. Look, she's run off and she's aggro in the zone, man. Look, she's dead now. She just run off and aggroed. Like, fucking trolls and all kinds of- I've got all kinds of shit around me now. Proper whore. Seriously. And they had a, they, they make a difference when you escort those NPCs and shit like that, but what could I do then? She just ran off and I couldn't even get up to her or blocked. Oh well. At least I can auto explore now. Oh, shall we actually level up? Yeah, here we go, right. So let's take that up to that. We're going to take willpower as high as we can. That will give us another class point, but we need level 4. No worries. Save us points for the time being. See, I mean, I love my acidic spray, man. It's fucking awesome. Let's put one point into armor training, just so we can use. Um. Heavy armors and one extra generic point into our heal. Shall save the class point and s I'm just going to dump it into that for the moment. Fuck it. There we go. Oh. No, no, fuck it, that'll do. I do accept changes. Right, time to uh, annihilate. 108. 108. 108, bitch. 108. 108. 108. Oh, you, 109. But you didn't die. Fucking troll. Got to YouTube. Oh, uh, there we go. And, uh, I, was, uh, I keep saying that, but I was <laughs> saying to Claire, like, I don't, I don't know why I even bother talking to Claire. I don't know why I even bother talking to you. Uh, do you know, I may as well just fucking wait until I'm recording and then talk to you. <laughs> Outside of that, we may as well just be silent. It saves me having to re repeat myself. Anyway, um, what, what, what was I saying to you before I started recording? Now I've forgotten. Kashi is quite annoying. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, that my curse was only level four, so I didn't have any big beef about restarting because I'm already level three, and I, you know, with speed at Wormick, just fucking flying around. It's like. I don't even have to fucking aim. In fact, I could have killed... It's a giant rabbit! I, <laughs> I don't know why, I was surprised to see one. I'm encumbered by picking up a rope. Get rid of some of this shit. Drop. 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 By the way, do you know, this is a thing I only learned yesterday as well. You know that dropping an item takes a turn? Yeah. Yeah, well, you would. I don't fucking know that. <laughs> I stood there dropping items and died. <laughs> I was a little bit embarrassed, but luckily I didn't say no at the time. You're dummy. Well, I didn't know if fucking dropping an item takes a turn. You're dummy. No. Um. Oh, nice! As if I found a psychic's regeneration infusion rune. So it scales off willpower, which I'm whoring the shout of at the moment. That's nice, is that? Get that used. Nice! It's like my racial scales with willpower, 
And that one I've just picked up scales with willpower, and the other one don't, but that's shit. 60 over 5 turns. My racial does 160 at the moment. It'll do more than that the more my willpower goes up as well. Anyway, um, am I still dropping items? No. Right, let's just equip anything that we can use. I need a two-handed weapon, really. No. I've got a wizard phase door rune as well. So it's on a nine second, uh, nine turn two cooldown. That's fucking good. Use that. Oh, which one? Oh, yeah. It's got rid of that sixty over five turns. That's that. That's not great. It's all right to begin with, but it's not great, is it? It's a bit fucking weak. Nah, that's what I'm talking about. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. What? 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 Ah, just uh, more lore. It'd be nice if it tell you like you've already read this lore. I never know if I've read it or not. Oh, here we go. The repent, the repented thief. Oh, okay. Um, lead on. I'll protect you. And when I say lead on, I mean be careful. Don't run and aggro the entire zone, please. Hee hee! Oh, what, what, I'm about to aggro the entire zone and then I just teleport around randomly. Sorry, I've cooled down. Help, thief to the north. Ah, you, you know your own, do you? It almost one-shots him. It took him down to 23% life at range on a melee character. That's good shit. Oh, the fuck, that hurt. Jesus. Let me rest. Oh, my God. Oh, he did it. He just ran off to his own place, did it? There you go. Farewell. Thank you. He didn't give me no... An escort quest didn't give me shit. He, 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 a repented thief. He's still a thief. No, I don't think so. Um, no, that's the wrong log. Um, Escort, level 3. As a reward, you have improved talent piercing sight. Oh my god, that sucks. <laughs> Allowing you to see stealth or invisible creatures. Increases stealth detection by 6 and invisible detection by 6. Oh, that could be worse. That was bullshit, that though. One guy charged off and died, and the other one fucking... I didn't click through it. I don't think I clicked through it too fast. It went, well done, you've done it. And then it was like, okay, farewell. I swear to God, I didn't, I didn't see no pop-up. I did not see a pop-up. I know that for a fact. And I don't think I clicked through it too fast. I mean, maybe I did, but I don't think I did. Maybe he only... No, they always give you different options, don't they? They don't just ever give you a set one. And you've played... You've never just seen one give you a guaranteed set one, have you? I must have clicked through it. I don't think I did, but maybe I must have done. Either way, still detection. Could be worse, couldn't it? What, have I, have I leveled up again? No. Oh well, they're only extras. Still coming handy, though. Wait, doing, don't, don't click around it! Oh god, fucking dancing around like a maypole, then. What's that? Oh, his recall Paul. He's a thief. He fucking only gave me one option. He's not repented at all. He still fucking steals. Steals the options of what? Yeah, he, 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 he stole my options. How fucking good is that city spray, man? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I did not quite recognise Prox the Mighty for a second, though. 22% in one hit on a boss. And then he knocked me across a lake. Thank you for that. Okay, he's just knocking me around the map. Fucking throwing me around. I am being highly surrounded by shit, I have to be honest. I have to teleport out of this shit. Give me that wolf. Oh dear, I have aggroed far too much things. Far too many. I don't think I can get him now though. Especially if I run away for a turn. Right, here we go. Yeah, that, I keep forgetting acidic spray is like a plasma, it, uh, a plasma gun, it shoots through stuff. Probably another reason why I'm so pleased about uh, acidic spray. Reminds me of fucking Space Crusadage. 
Oh, I'm level 3 by level fucking 2 on my Acid Express, so... <laughs> Chloe was just pointing out like, oh, well, it only goes through stuff at higher ranks. It's like, yeah, I've always got high ranks in that fucking thing. I am in combat. Let us scry. A huge tooth taken from the mouth in Deep Bellow. I got to the mouth. It's fucking hard, is that thing? Coral spray, skull cleaver. A small but sharp axe. I don't want small but sharp axes. I want large but sharp axes. In fact, I don't even care how sharp it is, it can be blunt, as long as it's large. It's a war axe, but it's only one-handed. One I don't really want one-handers. A lot of the... oh wait, what's this? 14 to 22.4 power. Iron great sort of projection. Damage when this weapon hits, plus 8 mind. It can be used to project an attack as mind damage, doing 100% weapon damage, placing all of the charms into a 6 second cooldown. Pretty solid real, especially for me. Better than the thing I had on, definitely. Um, two for the mouth. That's just a normal fuck it. I think that replaces- oh no, it goes on there, okay, cool. Um... Prismatic Iron Mail of cold resistance, better than what I've got on. I think everything else is... I can drop that. Everything else is... Chit. Yes, it seems so. Uh, do, 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 do. That's okay. Right. What do you want, snake? Pick up that. It's the... Um, I think that's saying about Bill. Bill the troll dude. Oh, armor's not as no- I will give that to the old RPG pack. When you get armors, he's gone out of his way to make sure that you can actually see it. I mean, I can see it on my little guy. He has changed his look. I don't think it's as noticeable, though. Like, when you get a big sword on the old RPG pack, you can tell you've got a big fucking sword compared to a little hatchet. Whereas on this, it's a two-handed sword that he's got in one hand, and it just looks like a regular-sized sword. I do like the look of this pack, though. The UI is definitely superior, and I, I, I just like the look of it. I don't know, I'll see how it goes anyway. I don't think I really regret um, not doing it vanilla straight away now. I don't think it really mattered, to be honest. I'm encumbered already, man. Give me a break. Drop that. Shit. Drop that. It's shit. Nuke that. It's shit. We are. Oh. I love it when it flies around the map looking for anything that you've missed. It's fucking great. You know, when you've explored everything pretty much, and then it has a, um... It, it's going, oh well, I'll just check before we go to the end of the level, and it just zooms all the way around the map and then goes to exit. Yeah. Your character. Oh, there you go. Okay. It. It. Um, right then. What's that do now? Projection. 100% weapon damage. It's not bad, that. Let's try it on that. We'll see how much damage it does. 35. They just heal it. Compared to Mr. Dick Spray. Yes, that hurt. Excuse me, that hurt a little bit more. Oh, well, it's another ranged attack. Yeah. Oh, holy shit! I got to get charged. Bill the Stone Troll rushes out and I got dazed. Ow! Fucking hurt. Oh my god. Minus regen, don't like minus regen at all. Oh yeah, spray through free trolls, man. Um, right then. What's it well health on fuck? Easy fella. Let's disarm him again. Right, as soon as I can get a heal going back again, where the fuck's me um, heal? What's wrong with it? Why is it off? Oh, I've still got regeneration effect, that's why. Right, now. There we go. Now he's dead. I don't care what he does to me, he's dead. Oh shit, why did I speak too soon? What else is he on? He's on 0%! My ass. I oh, know, he's got 3 hit points, so it's not registering as 1%, but still. There we go. Pick up items, I shall take all. I'm encumbered, which kind of sucks. Ah, scry. It's a very nice OTG. Alright. Oh, sorry, very nice, Liam. 
Umbral Razor, Unerring Scalpel. Uh, there's nothing that I'd like, though, is there? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. A Balanced Steel Great Maul. 27.5 minimum damage, which is higher than the 22.4 maximum damage of what I've got. And it goes up to 41.25. A shit ton of accuracy, a shit ton of defense, just no special effects. Fuck that, get it on. Nice. Nice. Still encumbered like a bitch, though. Let's get rid of that iron plate. Fuck it, it's too ever. Right, fucking low up, dude. Tink. Unidentified iron war axe, let's pick up that. Nuke this dude. Get rid of that off my bar. Get rid of that off my bar. TY. Ting, 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 ting. I like how it just auto loaded everything and sent me back to the exit in one simple press of the Z button, and the screen is done. It feels almost a little bit lame, but it's not. It's just speeding things up, innit? It's not like you're cheating or anything like that. It just seems like... Well, it's not, no, like I said, it's not too easy. There's nothing there, that's why it was easy. Anyway. Crystal Focus. I don't understand what that does. It can be used to combine with a weapon, costing one power out of one one. Huh? What's that do? This crystal radiates the power of the spell blaze itself. I'm gonna use it. Fuse with which weapon? Ah, uh, no, there's some weapons that say they can be enchanted. So maybe they go on that. I don't know. Either way. Let us... Rod of Recall. 40 turns later? <laughs> Fucking 40 turns, man. Let us go sell. At the town of... Change level. I don't know what the fuck it's called. Although, here we go. Durf. Durf! How could you forget the name of Durf? I don't know. Um, Jewless regeneration rune. Scales with dexterity. Go away. Scales with dexterity. Go away. Umbral razor. Not my bag. Not my bag. In fact, I don't think any of these weapons are my bag. Get rid of them all. Go away. Skull Cleaver's quite good though. If I did want to use a shield, no, I don't. Go away. I've got plans to use a, um, a Stone Warden who dual wield shields at some point, so I don't really need um, anything like that at the moment, I don't think. I believe that's it. Very swift sail there. Now, wasn't there a quest guy somewhere down here? Ah, yes, here we go. Sounds promising, almost. I would propose. I accept. Um, Dexterity and Cunning. Nope. I don't actually want any of these. Permanently crush your f physical critical strike by six. Dexterity. That's, these are all rogue things, but I'll have an elixir of precision, I guess. They were all rogue things there. Claire wants rogue things, but not me. This guy can talk. A tall, hooded man stares at you. Yes, yes, you look like a promising warrior indeed. I have an offer, human. You see, I'm an agent of the arena. I look for promising warriors that can provide a good show for our audience. Perhaps you are strong enough to join. All you need to do is beat three of my men in battle, and you shall be rewarded. You consider the offer of the mysterious hooded man for a moment. I'm interested. Tell me more about the arena. You can feel the man smiling from inside his hood. Uh, mm. Yeah, how, how would you feel somebody smile when you can't even see it? Well, whatever. It, it, it's, it's good law stuff. The arena is where the brave come to fight against all odds. We are still growing up, and we lack challenges. <laughs> Sorry, I keep accidentally in the mic in confoundment. Anyway, it's like a gamble, but use your fighting instead of money, you see. To play, you see, whatever. We in the arena work hard to make a good show, and in return, you can get enough wealth and glory to last for centuries. Because you'd need it to last for centuries. Oh, I don't matter. If you can pass my little test, I will allow you to join the arena when you are done with your adventures. You shall also gather some much needed combat experience for fighting our men. So, what do you think? Are you up to it? I am. Let's go. Mario Star, let's go. Oh, you know. The man smiles in approval. Excellent. A great fighter is always willing to head into battle. That's why I'm a great fighter. 
You certainly won't regret meeting us, indeed. So you're ready to fight? I told you like three screens ago, I'm ready. Man quietly walks away after making a, you after making you a gesture to follow him. Okay. He couldn't just said after gesturing you to follow him, but whatever. I, I, I like to pick at the small things. Defeat all three enemies. Oh, we've got Halfling Slinger. A Halfling Slinger? He seems adept at slinging. No, it doesn't say that. It says adept at combat, but still. He's level 8 to my 6. You see, this is what I was saying as well, guys. Look, I'm level 6 already. In half the time, and I spent the first 5 or 6 minutes talking about the differences now. Do you know, no add unpack and sorted a few recording things out and blah blah blah. What, you're not me back? Bitch, I'm not you back with your fucking acid spray. You wanna, you wanna play like Hunter Arena style fucking Warcraft shit going down over here? I'll fucking line the sight the shit out of you. Yeah, what do you think of that? And now I'll stand. Oh, you charged me, did you? I'm unable to move. I attack you in combat then. Hey, you, you wanna, do, you wanna be like that? I can't move again. Spray. There's some fucking music going down for this area in the arena. It's like Sonic Adventure kind of music or some shit going on. <laughs> oh, I can't move, he just constantly got me pinned. Still can't move, here we go, now I can move. Arcane Blade. A human arcane blade, his body shows multiple scars from battle. It's gonna show a few more scars when I'm gonna finish spraying shit all over him. Spray my fucking goo and shit. <laughs> I'm even, I'm proper adept at spraying Magoo as well because I can even shoot it round corners. What the fuck? That's fucking great. Look at that. Not like fucking, I don't even know what angles were involved with spraying around that fucking column there. Yeah! The Connacht Rogue comes back from the shadows. Well done, human. I knew you had potential. I'm a human as well. Why's he after you? Oh, anyway. The road takes off his hood, showing a fairly young but unmistakab unmistakably yeah, battle-hardened man. My name's Wretch. I work for the- what? Not Wretch. Reg. R-E-J. -E I work for the arena to recruit great fighters who can give a good show and not die in two blows. You're one of those indeed. I won't keep you away from your adventures. I was there too- what? I was there too long ago. But we can make you a true champion, beloved by many and bathing in diamonds. I like the um, the Family Guy episode recently when he had a lot of money or some shit like that. I don't know if it was even recently, it might have been months ago. Anyway, um, there was some parody of you know, like Scrooge McDuck's money bin, where he dives into all gold and swims around it and shit like that, and he just fucking Peter dives into it and just splats on the fucking thing. <laughs> it's how it would be, innit? It doesn't make like a water, does it? We all gold pieces and shit. It's solid as fuck. It's like hitting a brick wall, but harder. So no, you could not bathe in diamonds. I suspect that's even worse than Scrooge's money bin. And sharp. As you travel back to Durp in a company, in the com what well, in company of the rogue, you discuss your battles in the forest. Did I? Anyway, he I don't remember doing this. He provides you with great insight on your combat technique. Oh well, uh, yeah, I, I remember this. I remember some guy bigger. Two, plus two generic combat talents. It didn't say combat, I had that, but still. Very well, Liam. I must go now. Good luck in your adventures, and come visit us when you are done. Farewell. Oh, sorry. I will. Farewell for now. New achievement, the arena. Unlocked arena mode. Nice. The arena, a way of violent entertainment. A delight for the audience, a source of wealth and glory. A place where aspiring fi fighters, farmers, and former adventurers, and those cursed to fight, Eternally gathered hack away at each other. It didn't say farmers. I guess you're rereading that. I don't think it says that. It don't. You have, you have unlocked the arena and can now create new characters in a new campaign, the arena. The arena pits you against multiple enemies in an open field, making your battle tactics important for survival. Campaign features: no quests, plot, friendly creatures, or ways out. Only you against all odds. Exclusive scoring system where the faster you kill, the more you earn. Scores are kept for bragging rights. Pure hack and slash mayhem. And your champion becomes the new master of the arena, allowing you to challenge your own champions. That's alright. Pick up the money first. I'm gonna say. Oh, pick up the, pick up the item first. Acidic Iron Mace. It's crap. Still, it's mine. P. 
Right, let's max out our acidic spray. Corrosive mist, also very good. I need more willpower, so let us do so. Oh, into the next of corrosive thing. Uh, willpower 26. Oh, I think we can do it. Willpower 26. Oh, willpower 28. I think we can do it. Willpower 28. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I need level 7. Boo. Fuck it, I'm having more willpower. Wait a minute, what happened? Did I accidentally put a point in somewhere there? But not done. Nah. Well, I'll save my points for later on. Still pumping that. Let's pump up a strength a little bit. Put up to 20. Allows you to wear shields. Not really interested. I'm not really interested in massive plate, neither. I'll, I'll wait for later on, but I mean, he may as well. I will be going strength, just not yet. Put generic point there, generic point there. Um, we'll get extra turns, fungal growth, and that. There we go. Uh, well, that worked out very well. Very well. Now I've got another heal. I've also got extra turns on my heals, and uh, every time I'm healed, I gain 28% extra heal. It's like, Jesus Christ. Plus, I've upgraded all my acidic spray and got four ranks of corrosive mist and shit. It's like, my god, that was a good level. Um, yeah, fuck it, that'll do. I do accept changes. Let us go to Corpul, I believe. That's all this shit down here, I've not even looked at that. That's another heal, that. Gimme it. Gimme it, stop loading. Stop saving. There, there we go, right. So put that to the heal, that's the break. What's this? Wild growth. Oh, it's just to sustain us, that. Can I rest on there? No, don't run around! What's he doing? Jesus! Just fucking shot me around the map there. I don't want to shoot around the world map like an idiot. Right, wild growth, sustain that shit. Sustain it, you can't cast it on the world map. Oh, I see, I can run around, but I can't fucking sustain a spell. Fuck you. Right. Yeah, let's get some dungeoneering on again. I like the dungeoneering music as well, turn my volume up for that shit. Wild growth, sustain that. That's the, every time you get healed, you heal some more. Oh, a little 15 guy died there. How unfortunate for him. Not many people dying today. Except Claire. Although, I, I don't think I've seen you die since... It's like, Claire was struggling as like the Yeek race, and they have a really hard starting zone, apparently. And, um, Claire must have died about f ten times before I started recording or something like that. Claire reckons about 25, actually. But then, as soon as I started recording, just before that, you've been on the same character now, haven't you? Yeah, I'm actually level 7. <laughs> You're only just level 7? I'm 7. Uh, yeah, yours is yours is harder, and I'm just going around one shot and stuff. Boom, 129, bitch. I like the doors more in the normal pack as well. They actually look like doors and stuff properly. Like I say, I'm I'm still a bit split between um, which pack I prefer more. I think the old RPG pack's got more character. I think this one's slightly less offensive, and not offensive, but you know what I mean, like, it, it's less jarring in places than what the old RPG one, and the UI is better than this one, definitely. So, I, I'm not sure, I'm not sure yet. Oh, yeah, I've already about before, the um, skeleton with no arms, that's why you could take him on. Yep, and the guy that was broke. Like I say, apologies if you um, wanted me to read out some of the stuff, if I, uh, my opinion is, if I've read it once before, I'm not going to waste time and read it again. I'll read it out once, but you know, not. Ooh, an iron great mall. Let's um, have a scry of that shit. What? Oh, it's just, oh, it's just a white. Fuck it. I thought it were a great. Ooh. Salustra, the white worm mass. Oh, I just gooed the fuck out with two white worms. I've, I've, I've not even needed me. This acid spray is pretty good as well, here, yeah, Cross of Mists. So. Oh, wait, did I level up? No. Um. This disowns this thing as well. Look at that, that killed something out right there. And then I'm just gonna spray down the corridor. And everything else is dead. Look at that, man. That was great. It died before I even did anything to it. Because of the um, poison AoE, it's fucking great. Look at that! Compared to the other characters that I've played. This guy's a beast. No burden. Oh, oh my god, something survived a turn? Holy shit. Um, no, don't go down yet. Let's get experience. Oh, oh, oh you, you want me to pick up some of you? There we go. Spray. Hey, wait. 
Ow, when it someone hits me, it hurts though. <laughs> it's a bit can it, man. The melee class, which is like stronger than any range class I've played so far, nuking stuff in one shot. I don't. Well, I've not attacked either of these two. How easy is that? We gold. Open that chest. Yay! I, you know, I like it when shit pops out of the chest and it's like elites and stuff like that. Well, rares. It's good experience. You've win the rattlesnake and Nero Lima, the brown mold. A strange brown growth on the dungeon floor. And as you approach, the snake coils up and rattles its tail threateningly. Threaten this bitch. Oh shit, it locked out my fucking skills. There we go. Oh yeah! One spray, two kills. Come in line of sight. Come in line of sight. What happened to the skeletons? Oh, you fool. Just die melee style for being awkward. Pick up item. Pick up item. Pick up item. Oh, I'm encumbered. Best get rid of some shit. Drop. 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 Apparently, uh, well not apparently, for fact. If you do a certain quest or something like that, I mean, Claire's got it, you get this box and it just auto loots items for you. And then at the end, when you leave the stage, you select which items you want to take, or which items you just want to dump. Or does it auto sell and stuff like that for you as well? It's a, It sounds really fucking good actually, I do need to get that. Heh <laughs> sun turn. It's an infusion. Um, no, it's a uh, mind star. Fucking hell, they always confuse me. Void Wedge. Well, better than the boots I've got, because I don't have any boots. Need strength 22 for that, and armor talent 3. Mental crit chance, plus 1%. Changes stat, plus 4 cunning. It's not awesome, but it's not bad. Don't have any gloves either, I don't think. What do they do? Plus 4 strength, plus 3 dex. Could be worse. Um. Yeah, that seems fine. That'll do. I already opened that chest, man. Oh, wait, I did pick up the item, so. A oh, purple out of it. A glacial elm longbow of true flight. Sounds very good. Has to check all the doors, even if they lead nowhere. Has to check them. This door seems to have been sealed off. You think you can open it? I know I can open it. I could stand here and just like acidic, uh, not acidic spray, sorry, corrosive mist and get shit tons of stuff in there. Yep, there's stuff in there. Oh, what is there? I thought there was. Oh, there's one. Ah! I'm a skeleton, it's lean for 44 physical and 50 physical. It did 92 to me? What a bitch! It's 22 elite! No! Close door. I can't. Why is there a 22 elite down here, man? Actually, I'm kind of on them. I've just got to run away. He's dead? 22 elite? I must have read that wrong. Because there's no way at level 7 I can take a 22 elite. I must have read that wrong. No, there's a lot of level 22s down here. Zorn, a level 22. He is not quite going to go down as easy. Actually, yeah, he did. The hell? Why are level 22 so easy? No wonder I'm raping. They're usually around the same level as me, though. Not like... That's, that's a bit of a difference compared to the usual shit around here. Level 24, Humanoid Orc. Just kite him around a little bit, spray him. And we'll spray him again. Oh shit, that hurt. Oh my god, I'm dead. I should have teleported first. That's just from relaxing too much. I'm ready to go. Oh no, wait. Let's get that stained again. Damn, that was a wasted life for that. Damn 
hurts. I keep forgetting about my instant heal as well. That was stupid of me with that. Would fall for that mistake again. Oh wow. Shit, that hurt. Am I poisoned? I think I am, you know. Oh my god. Please do not kill me. No, I'm alright now. Fucking hell, that was close to that. I shouldn't have died. Fuck these mind stars that I keep picking up. I shouldn't have died to that, but... All the other were fucking level 22s so were so easy around there, I didn't really think much of them. A necromancer poem? A poem written by a necromancer? The necromancer's canticle. That's cool. That's a cool word. Canticle. Save from coffin, casket urn, darkness falls, but life returns. Flesh may fall and bone may burn, but soul remains, for which we yearn. This one just sat down and fucking made a poem. Necromantic style. Those we return to life's esteem, we see their hearts, their eyes do gleam. They rave, they kill, they gnash, they scream, so full of joy, their greatest dream. Returning those that we amend, they hurry home, a distant friend. But do they cheer? Do they commend? They yell. Does rotting flesh offend? We bring life to lifeless bone. But do they smile? Do they condone? They sit upon their golden thrones. They shun us, spurn us, make unknown. Fools sit in high golden tower. From your lofty perch you glower. From time will come when you will cower. We rule death, we wield the power. I think he started off stronger than the ending there, but still not bad. Can I do you a favour? What's that? All the, he All the healing stuff. Okay, I don't know what I did for you, but no worries. It was, it was hard work, but I did it. Um, don't want to sell that. Oh, I need some heavy that I can drop. That stuff. There we go. And to the next level. A brown mole. Yeah, le level six. Not level twenty-two. Journal page. Oh, I don't think I read this one before. Corpul, Corpul. When the farmer told me what this place was called, it reminded me of s something, and I think it's coming back to me now. My mother used to tell me a story about our ancestors, how they fled by ship to escape the grasp of an evil sorcerer who dominated the lands. The sorcerer was a vile necromancer who took advantage of the destruction from the spellblaze and the cataclysm to create, a hu to create huge armies of undead. The people fought against him time and time again, but though he would be defeated, it would still come back, sometimes after hundreds of years. And that sorcerer's name was Corporal. Probably just a, co a coincidence. Not really, because it's a big, it's a big tower, and um, I'm sure the maker of this has played a lot of EQ. The similarities from time to time, like the like, I've never seen a game since EQ really bother that much about lighting. And it sounds like you were saying always keep a lantern on you, but you mainly play humans, and they've probably got no vision at night, no night vision. So when you go into dark areas, your fucking your sight radius just diminishes to note almost. But the elves and the dwarves, I bet have a much larger light radius. Probably quite fine. You sure? Positive? I bet, I bet, I bet the races other than human have a bit of light radius in dungeons and dark areas. Or at least they've got infravision or something like that or whatever else. But is that on? Have you tried that on all races? Or oh, is it mainly stuff human? Uh, I'll I'll try it at some point and see um, 
see if there's any difference. I don't know, just seeing shit like Infravision and Ultravision and stuff like that just reminds me of fucking EverQuest. But like, um, like this like Corpul's Tower here, well, ruins of Corpul, but it's basically Corpul's Tower, which is kind of similar to Kern's fucking tower in EQ and shit like that. I'm sure that were a big necromancer guy, that fucking, that were his tower. Anyway, good, I don't see it as a bad thing. Leech that EQ stuff, I like it. Oh, we survived the net. Ow, we hurt. Level 10. I'm level 7 still. My rate has slowed down somewhat. I'm just encumbered. I spend more time dropping shit than anything else. I'm encumbered like a bitch all the time. Let's get rid of some of There, drop, drop that. Too much loot. Not enough enemies. Oh, I see. AoE time. Oh, look at this. A, a corner... A corner shot, like round the corner, and it's gonna hit three things. Look at that! Oh my god, that was awesome. How do you how do you manage to shoot that shit round the corner? How do you spray your ghoul like that? I don't know. It's in pretty fucking impressive. This is gonna be good as well. Wait a turn. Keep coming, lads. Whoa, why is my life so low? No. I don't seem to have any kind of like armor or constitution or at the moment, so if something does hit me, it hurts. I'm sure you can do something with walls that I've never done before. Let's dig that wall out. Oh, it didn't do much. Just yeah. What the fuck? How did they get around there? Wee, 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 wee. What the fuck? Hey, up. Poly Tiri Pol Poly Did you name after bounce like that? Polyatira? The large brown snake? This large snake kisses at you, angry at being disturbed. It's not my fucking fault. It's not my fault you're almost dead, you didn't even get to me. Spark winter. Oh my god, I'll drop the i I'm dropping haven't I dropped greens and shit? No, I can't pick up anymore. What's that? Brass Lantern of Health, pick it up. What's that? Set up Sonic Shield, reducing all physical and acid damage. Oh, pick it up, it must be light. It's not light! Not as light as I expected, anyway. Insulating high enamel high strength, can I wear that? That's better than no. Doesn't change my encumbrance problem, though. Um, get, oh, get rid of the Mind Stars, man. Why is it, why's there so many Mind Stars in this game? It's like a million of them. Four million. It's a lot. Wait, what's that? Flaming eye. Oh, it's crap. Just like a skeleton. No, explore first. Explore. Previous level. What what's have I got? Void wedge. Surely that's better. Should have really looked. I could have known if it was better or not then, but no worries. What's that? Iron plate, I've cut, no, I've, I think I've already got some of that shit. No, I don't want that. I've got too much art, I've too much fucking equipment, man. None of which I'm actually using, it's just too much fucking loot. Need more strength. What's it gonna give me? Loads of enemies, good. Loads of shit ones, though. Can I... line you all up? You all died, but I was trying to line them up and they all died before I could. What's that first door room? Ah, fuck it. Ooh, what, what, what was there? A blurring, rough lover belt of recklessness. I like blurry belts. The more I've, I mean, I, I've said it quite a lot this um, this part, like, but like I was sent a clue before I started recording, like, the more blurry a belt, the better. Oh, five stealth bonus. That's gonna come in under. Ah, well. I think it's probably better than what I've got. Spell power plus three. Yeah. Yeah, fuck it, it's alright. What? A copper ring. Rings can have magical properties, but this one doesn't. Or at least I'm not doing it right. Maybe you can enchant it somehow or some shit, I don't know. Wee 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 wee! 
Suck it. Suck it. A journal page. It's quiet down here, and dark. Very dark. I suppose I could have brought a lantern. A motto to bring light into dark places... Ah. Should have thought about that in practical terms. I've read it before. Hey, what got frozen? Oh, I remember this guy. Um, how many more turns? Ah, let's get rid of that. Where is it? There he is. Ouch. Stung a little bit there, mate. Oh, I just clicked on him like an idiot. I just spam clicked through him. What an idiot. Do not do that. I've got two lives left. Don't do that. That was silly. That's two lives now from being reckless. I just clicked on him. Click, 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 click. Why? You can't do that. You can't do that. It's oh, and I just reset my progress on him. How very cool. You've got to take it carefully. Look at that, how easy it is. I didn't... I shouldn't have lost a life on that. It's two lives I've lost now. Oh my god, I'm so sick of seeing that. I'm encumbered. Course fall. That looks shit. Shit. Oh my god, what? Oh man, I'm 50% overweight. <laughs> I've got to get rid of some shit, man. Now I'm training level 3 and strength 22. Drop that shit. Do I have anything else that I could drop? Spiked iron male armor. That's better than what I've got at the moment, I think. Prismatic. Yeah, let's drop that. So I need to dro drop about 3 armor. Acidic snow, um... What is that? Acidic guy? Yeah, drop that. Right. What? 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 What now? Oh, you just picked some up. Cool. Wee! Oh. Wee! Oh. What's that? What's that? Oh my god, fuck off with your mind stars. Mind stars look like bloody infusion runes as well. So I keep seeing one and getting excited like it's gonna be something good and then it's a fucking mind star. What, what did you stop for? A flaming iron dagger? No, just open the door, you don't need me. I'll hold your hand on it. Fuck that. I don't have no room. I keep telling you. That hand, they were a fucking ant hiding away. What's that, what's that? What, what, am, I, what am I on now, what's that? Oh, the previous level. Alright, oh, we're done down here then. No. It, it stops me and I'm like, what the fuck, what's going on? Uh, what a recall. And 40 turns later, We had done Corporal. There we go. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Cheers for watching, and I shall catch you next time. Possibly. It might be me. It might not be. Anyway, see you dudes.